Are you tired of being confused in MC edits? Well, you've come to the right place. Because today, we'll be doing MC edits 2.0. So, let's get started. So, I'm going to be showing you how to do the confusing things of MC edits. Uh, for MC Edits 2.0, which is the newest version of MC Edits, so uh, once you start MC Edit up after you've downloaded it, it's gonna look like this with your uh, with your actual window, and here you go. So you're gonna choose what world you want, and then you're just going to press Edit the World, um, in which it will load the spawner right here. So that's pretty much going to be what you need to do. So many people like to get triggered about the new MC Edit version because it's not as good as the old one. Um, but the, you know, I think it's pretty much the same thing as, as long as you get to know what you're doing It's really not gonna be that bad. You can move around the highlighted area right here by uh, just dragging it You can drag it up and down and left and right and all the different things you want to do with it uh, It's gonna take different amounts of times doesn't it really depends on how big the the freaking amount of things you want to spawn in this uh, in this scenario, so I mean if you're trying to spawn like freaking Battlestar Galactica's giant uh, spaceship or just Halo 3's uh, giants, orbital planets, whatever you want to spawn something like that, then it's probably going to take a few days to do that. Um, so just leave your computer on overnight and it will be fine. Um, but as you can see right here, these are all things that I've spawned earlier with MC Edits. Uh, so basically, it's all going to end up looking like this. Uh, what I usually do is if something is wrong, you'll just do press Control Z and that will uh, basically undo everything you did before. And obviously the most basic thing is move WASD and changing the brightness of the actual thing. Or you can make it extremely bright and you're burning your eyes out. Um, or the time of day, make it dark time again. Or just burn your eyes again. Um, work plane, which is like that. And you could uh, choose whatever you want. Like uh, get the grid at certain distances. But just really doesn't matter. Uh, you could do 2D where you could do an overlay of the map. Um, or that's what this is pretty much. Um, or you could also do that by pressing tab or you could just go back to camera. There you go uh, Also edit player something you could do in order if you want to change where your player is at and what's going on This is in the inventory currently when I left off in the game, but you can add stuff in your inventory I don't know why you would need to do that. I don't know. It's kind of redundant I don't know why you'd want to add something in there. It's kind of stupid I mean, but you know if you really are just that desperate and you just you don't know how to do things right You might want to just add some stuff through MC edit uh, basically, it's it's self-explanatory. Player, game, creative. You can change the creative level, uh, and score, and then uh, food level and exhaustion level, the amount of air, time, the amount of um, I don't I don't know how far you're falling, how high you are. Change the height highness of yourself. Uh, also over here to the left, the brush tool, which essentially makes you create whatever you want, any sort of shape with any block. I, like what the heck? <laughs> I got no idea what this is. I got no idea what, what this is right here. Or you could just do this. I'll make it kind of like a pyramid thing. Change the block number here. Change it to water. Or you can change it to uh, wood. Or change it to leaves. Or beds. What happens if you do beds? Oh my god, that's gonna start. Oh, it's not lagging as bad as I thought. Now you got a giant pyramid of beds. Better than ever with your giant pyramids, pyramid of beds. And these uh, little question mark blocks here, that means it's uh, not recognized. It means it's, it's too good for MC edits and it doesn't know what's going on, which is why they just do some random pink thing with a, a little mark saying they don't know what's going on with it. Pretty much gone over all the uh, crazy awesome and yet confusing things that everyone hates about it. Um, but the generate is probably by far the most, um, the best thing you can do in a, in that sort of sense. Because it's like, you know, like, you can generate whatever you want. And yeah, that's pretty much everything you need to know. But MC Edit, it's, it's really not even that hard. Um, and everything here is quite easy to do once you just, once you learn it and you know what you're doing, it's really easy to just get the hang out of it. Uh, and, um... I mean, honestly, oh, I'm moving this around again. Freak me, I just spawned two of them. God, we got two ginormous pyramids of beds all over the place. And, uh, this did help you, didn't it? Well, it probably did, but if it didn't, then, uh, well, I don't know what to tell you. But if it did, then, um, please leave a big blue hand, because that would really help my channel out. And I will see you guys in the next one. Have a good one. Goodbye.